Hard fought loss for Milwaukee after taking the first set. Look at that, three consecutive set wins for Cleveland State by two points and they rally from behind and set number four as Milwaukee got out to a four nothing lead. Milwaukee was up five to one and then Milwaukee even led it 24-22. Cleveland State then scored three in a row to get up 25-24 and ultimately prevailing over the Panthers 27 to 25. So we're joined now by Emma Walker, one of the senior leaders for Cleveland State. Emma, thanks so much. Congratulations to you and your team. What a hard fought match. How did you come out on top? We just really believed in ourselves. It was a team effort, one point at a time. We knew we could do it. We just had to prove it. Yeah, what was being said uh, in your huddle, first off, when you dropped that first set? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, just. Getting the jitters out that first set was really important for us. We knew we could play better, and we proved it to ourselves. And we kind of just lived by the mantra one point at a time. We got to move on right away. Yeah, you yourself finished with 47 digs tonight. Oh, really? Yeah. OK. And is that a career high for, for you? For sure, yeah. Yes, and we're going to have to double check. <laughs> but I think that's one of the highest counts, not only in the Horizon League, but in the country yeah. this year. So I guess, how are you feeling out there on the court tonight? I mean, I couldn't do it without my team, my blockers, all my other defenders. They give me the strength to do it, and I owe it to them. Yes, and according to our information, the 47 digs here in this match tonight actually tie Kara Erdman, who <laughs> earlier this season had 47 in the match, for the most in any match in the country this oh, year. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's great to be surrounded in the Horizon League by such great liberos. It's good competition for me. Yeah, so now here in your senior season, you've got a chance to compete for a spot in the NCAA tournament mm -hmm. tomorrow against Green Bay. How's that sound? It sounds amazing. All we're doing tonight is focusing on recovery, getting ready for the game tomorrow, and we know we can do it. We just have to prove it to ourselves. Yeah, last one for you here. Obviously, you're well familiar with Green Bay over the course of your career. You guys won both matches against them. That was more than a month ago, though, in October. What do you take away from those matches, and what do you think will be key to winning again tomorrow? You know, we'll watch the film back, I'm sure, and go over the game plan, but we know it's a new Green Bay team. I'm pretty sure there's some players that were out the first time that are playing again, so we just got to focus on who they are now. Okay, Emma, congratulations once more, and best of luck getting ready for that tomorrow. Thank you.